I'm in, I'm in. Yeah. Well, good day, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of the Albino Rhino Fuck Booze. You. Psychic. Booze review. Booze review. Internet. Here you have the rhino, the pants, the other husband, the honey monster, the boo berry, uh, the man child's in the background screaming, fuck you. Um, <laughs> We Pinch have says, we oh, have a shit. maple whiskey that was sent to us from uh, Katie at Domain Pinnacle. Thank you very much for this sample, Katie. Uh, this is Carreur. I, I I took French in grade nine, which was years ago. Carreur de Bois, uh, thirty-one point seven percent ABV, which is a pretty good ABV. Yeah. Mm -hmm. On a 40% whiskey. Uh, anyway, uh, ingredients... Uh, was, 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 sorry. Inspired by Quebec whiskey tradition. Coureur de Bois is a unique blend of Canadian whiskey and pure premium maple syrup. Serve on ice or in a cocktail and awaken the spirit of adventure in you. Well, we're, we're drinking it on its own and not chilled. It says serve chilled. <laughs> we're fighting that serve chilled. Um, cool cocktail. Right. Yeah. Canadian whiskey and pure maple syrup liqueur. What's that? What does this say? Snap. <laughs> um, I don't fucking know. <laughs> it's in French. Terroir du Quebec. Anyway. Terroir du Quebec. So, Domaine Pinnacle, the number one producer of ice cider in the world, also makes their own uh, own liqueurs and spirits. This is a maple a maple whiskey, and yeah, Quebec, as much as some people don't like to announce it or admit it, Quebec makes the uh, the best maple syrup, I'd say, ever. In the world. Oh, you can smell it. I'm not even close oh, yeah. to it. You can smell the aroma. That smells like whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> don't mind the honey monster. He is drunk at this point in time. <laughs> it smells like ma maple syrup. That's what you go, get. Honey monster. Oh, fuck. Well, it tastes like whiskey. It's, oh wow! Yeah. Like all I can yeah. smell. Like you would want to put this on your fucking uh. pancakes. Done. <laughs> get me a fucking waffle. <laughs> no. You know no. I can put this on your. On your Do not put this on waffles. Yeah, you can put this on work. any breakfast food. From the way it smells. Yes, from the way it smells, you can put this on any breakfast food. No. Period. No, you can't. We've tried Alicia. No. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. Yeah. Okay. Well, maybe it doesn't work, but it smells like it would. Yeah, so it you smell like it. it would. Smell exactly. Like that's what I'm getting at. You smell it, and what you get is maple syrup. And I'm not talking like Aunt Jemima or anything no, like no, that. True Actual maple. true maple syrup. Yeah. My my grandfather lives in Renfrew, which is right along. The Ontario Quebec border. He has a maple bush. He makes his own maple syrup. This is exactly yeah. what it smells like. His maple syrup. He's a maple bush, eh? He has a maple bush. <laughs> <laughs> a maple bush. Taste it. Sticky. I've tasted his maple bush, yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, it, it, right. it, it looks like sap. whiskey. Color? It smells great. It smells amazing, just like maple and nothing else. Um, to all the people mm. here. And they kept so the shoulder of the chair. Cheers. 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 Vive la France Hubert. Not a chance. No France. You mean a pas de France? And oh. oh my god, is this it heavenly. Does it taste, yes. like, it tastes oh so sweet. Oh my god. It's, yeah. it's maple syrup. He's having a crisis. Yeah. It's I really like, am. It tastes like if it's you guys notice this alcohol, bottle was not honestly. brand new, and that's because I keep drinking it. The problem is, I could sit down here and drink this whole oh, yes. fucking bottle and not have a problem with oh, it. Yeah. No, because, it tastes like well, it's like 10% like alcohol. Later, yeah, yeah. But, um, Not a problem doing it. Yeah, it's 31.7% so alcohol. So There's sweet. a little bit of alcohol warming in the throat. Just a little, like right here, like. just a little. That's it. You don't get that burning mm. dance. No. Like that, mm. A warm, but not so, a burning. Yeah. Exactly, pants. This is so great. Exactly. This is exactly what, like, it's the best maple whiskey I've had. I've had honey whiskey. It's I've really had cherry good. whiskey. I've, I've had, had maple whiskey. I've had a couple maple whiskeys. This is the best maple whiskey I've had thus far. Um, I wish this was available in Ontario no because it's like you need to brush I would buy bottle after bottle of this. Honestly, I would keep exactly. this on the shelf all the time. Yeah. I might. I don't. What? <clears throat> oh. It's yeah. almost worth the drive to Quebec. Um. What do you guys taste? Again, for me, it's just a little bit of warmth and, and maple, maple syrup. And maple syrup, yeah. And butter. No, no alcohol. Butter, and butter. buttery, caramel. yes. You well, get a little, caramel. you get enough buttery caramel. Yeah, that's that's like a yes. butterscotch exactly. toffee. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Butterscotch. A butterscotch toffee with 
maple and a little yeah. bit of a warmth. Yeah. It's amazing. Ratings? It is. It's amazing. Anybody else have any other flavors that they pick up? That's it. Buttery maple, a little bit of alcohol. Yeah, the sad, I can't the scary believe. thing is we've never all agreed on the exact same in, same taste. What could you mix coriander. with Coriander. I think we've all agreed on coriander. <laughs> <laughs> coriander. At least once. Um, what? I don't... If you were to make a mixed drink know, with this, would it be in like hot chocolate maybe? You know what? This could go great in hot chocolate. Oh. Uh, I make... No. I no. 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 Ice cream. No. no. Ice, well, ice cream. No, I could see ice this cream's not on mixed. Top of the Talking ice cream. about like a drink. If you were to make a cocktail out of this. Maybe I could see this being cocktail? used in a in a. If you were to make a cocktail out of this, you if, could probably do it with bourbon. You know what? I do a very nice. Uh, I do a very nice root beer, uh, root oh, beer shot, yeah, yeah. and I could yeah, use this instead of the vanilla. This would make a boiler maker. <laughs> yeah, that would be a ridiculous boiler maker. Like, I don't yeah. think it'd be terrible. It would work. Ginger. No, really? a ginger wouldn't be bad either. Um, Maybe so like a rye ice? ginger and maple. We can try that some other time. We have Why, we have another right? bottle of this too. We can do some shots of it. Can I give that a smell? No, root beer. I will not drink it. I can check. Well, how come you don't drink it? I don't think I'm hard alcohol. This doesn't taste hard at all, but oh my god, it smells like butter. So out of ten, guys, out of ten. Out of ten. Ten. Um, I really enjoy. I thought it was very good, but um, I actually like Sotelier's better. Um, sort of the, uh, actually has a better flavor See, overall. See, that's, that's not one I've ever had. Uh, yeah, I actually like it as a okay. maple overall. This is really? more of like a butterscotch well, sort of taste, really? um, which is very no. good. But at the not same time, I think as an actual maple whiskey, out. sort of yeah. better. I still would probably give this an 8.5. Eight yeah, like just this a flavor set. Droplets. Uh, ten. Droplets. Like at least a 9.5 for me. Uh, I would say a 9. I'll give it an 8. Out of 10? <sighs> like oh my god! Eight point five solid. Eight point five. You don't drink liquor. Gorgeous. Eight point five. Gorgeous. Eight point five. I don't drink whiskey. Okay. This isn't whiskey. <laughs> or whatever the hell this is. <laughs> I don't. I don't drink hard <laughs> alcohol. Oh, like here to whiskey. I don't Shut drink up. hard alcohol at all. But that is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. He just had a droplet too. Is yeah. yeah. I. I don't. The drink term like, is crisis. Honestly. Yeah, I think it's it's yeah, that is more of a liqueur than anything else. Yeah, you're right. It's, yeah. Like, so it's out of not 10, as much of a whiskey. I have nothing to gauge it on, it but, but honestly, the fact that I can drink it and not want to throw up, I give that like a nice sweet. Um, yeah, just like a solid 8.5, yeah, solid across the board. You can use it. It doesn't have to serve. You can use it cook. You can use it shoot shooting first, cooking second, mixing third. That's what I'd give it. 9.25 for me. This is the uh, this is great. Um, the only reason it has a 0.75 off of it is because I can't get it, it here. In Ontario. Yeah. <laughs> oh, if I could shit. get this in Ontario, it would be like exactly. a 9.75 or a 10. Oh my Who's god. Who's gonna dance? I'm well, dancing. I have to dance. I gotta dance. dance. Everybody but the Pollock. Yeah, I don't know. Kenny and I Timmy. Yeah. So what's Bart Chuck is so embarrassed by this that he's actually like doing shit so he doesn't have to look at me right now. But we are going to do the crisis dance, which basically means you and I were faking orgasms. So we are going to fake orgasms. Well, I do that every night with my wife. On... <laughs> we're gonna fake yep, orgasms. That's why you have two children. We're gonna fake orgasms on YouTube. So we can see your O faces? Just for you so you can see our O faces. <laughs> You, you're going to see. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> Your old face. Good sir. <laughs> see that? I can actually, I can actually stop the blood vessels in my neck right. and make my head shake the whole time. Right. <laughs> I, I'm going to try that. Okay, I, I'm going to do a revised O face just so I can try and do that. <laughs> no, I can't do it. I just I feel like I'm going to poop if I do that. Can you move your ears because that's where the blood vessels no, are. No, yeah, see? I can't do that. Yeah, see? I'm going to shit my pants if I try that. Well, look at you. You're the man. I have full on muscle control. You have that full muscle control. You're having an orgasm right now. I'm not quite sure what. Yeah, no, no. Anyways, take care of you too. The man who shit.